Hey, what's going on guys? I just want to drive here, and I'm just here with a quick little video for an update on my bucket seats. Now, I got my brackets in a couple days ago, and I wanted to test fit them real quick uh, before I actually made a video of me installing them, and they're actually here in the box right now. Now, why are they in the box? Because I test fitted them first, so why are they in the box? Well, let's go take a look at my bucket seats really quick. They're in my room, and you know, let's go. Let's go look at them. All right, so we're in my room. There's my seats right there. Let me focus. Focus. All right, there's focus. See, so I have the sliders on down there. Now, why aren't they in my car? because they should be in my Miata right now. Now here's the problem. The, the, the seat brackets that I got, the slots, that are, the slots that are in the bracket, they don't quite line up with the holes that are in uh, the floor of my car to where you bolt in the bracket. They're, one of the brackets is just like a little, a little off, and the other one, it's, it's completely off. And they're, the brackets are made by NGK, I mean, not NGK, NRG. <laughs> and so, you know, it wasn't a, um, what's the word? Oh, let me think of the word. Oh, I can't think of the word, but it's like a one size fits all. You, you know what I'm talking about, right? I, I just can't think of the word. But yeah, it was, it was made for these seats, and the holes don't line up. None of the slots line up with the holes. So, <clears throat> I, I can't. I can't bolt it to my car. So I called the shop up that I got them from. They ain't answer. And I left a message telling them to call me back because, you know, the whole the slots weren't drilled right. And they didn't they haven't called me back. And it's been a couple of days. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with the brackets yet. I'm trying to get them taken back, but you know another Thing when I was trying to uh, put these in is I'm too tall for my Miata now because the the brackets they it, it lifts the seat off the ground a few inches and that's a few inches too much for me and whenever I have the top over my head hits the top so yeah that's a problem and these seats aren't really a priority to me right now so I'm probably just gonna sell them because I'm trying to get my turbo and I can use the extra what two two fifty two hundred dollars that I can get for it for my uh, turbo so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna sell these um, and, then I'm gonna buy, and then I'm gonna buy some like bride bucket seats that I originally wanted uh, later on so if I even get bucket seats I'm not even sure because of my height but if I can find a bracket, or even custom make a bracket that just fits flat on the floor, that will be great. But for now, unfortunately I'm going to have to sell these. But, you know, it just gives you more money for the turbo build. And I'm going to be ordering the kit, hopefully next Wednesday. Because that's when I get paid. So, yeah. Just a little video telling you guys what's going on with my seats and why they're not on my car so thanks for watching guys subscribe for more comment like the video and thanks for the early support alright have a good one